what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? You knew it was coming. Armed robberies have spiked in Santa Ana, California, as criminals are taking full advantage of the acceptance and even requirement of face mask due to the coronavirus. Yeah, it's going down. Some of the shop owners are shook because they're saying between the hoodies and the shades and the mask, they don't know who's coming into their establishments. I'm surprised that the spike has just happened. Perhaps it's because people are getting desperate now. The longer this lockdown uh, stays in place, most of these stay at home orders stay in place, the more desperate people are going to become because they're getting sucked in like a vacuum and money is drying up and people still got to eat. Some landlords ain't playing no games. They still want their money. They're not waiting. So people need money. And some people are not waiting for the stimulus check to arrive. They are going out and shaking the trees and see what falls on the ground. Whatever falls, they're picking it up and running. It's not just in Santa Ana. Santa Ana is one of the few uh, cities that has actually done data and put out a report, but it's happening also in Texas. The armed robberies has spiked. Now, they're also saying that it could be because a number of inmates are being released due to the coronavirus. They're letting inmates out of jail and out of prison early to protect the prison environment. And they're keeping the, the most uh, dangerous people in jail. Now, that part don't really add up because they consider people who commit armed robberies to be dangerous. That's why if you get caught up in an armed robbery, you don't go to Club Fed, you go to Club Max. They send you to a maximum prison, you know, or at least a minimum prison when you commit an armed robbery. So we'll see how that go. I suspect that the trend will continue. And I also suspect that there's going to be some people who are going to start squeezing off on those triggers. Yeah, this is going to be tough. They were saying in California also that uh, perhaps because they have a no arrest uh, rule in place right now, where they're not even making arrest unless the arrest is really serious. One guy got arrested like three times in one week for theft. But this is armed robbery, so this is not really adding up to me. Armed robberies are serious because when you pull a gun out on somebody, you never know when you're gonna squeeze the trigger. The person on the other end is terrified. You stick a gun in somebody's face. They just see their light flash right before them. People start praying and all kinds of stuff. Hyperventilating. Uh, yeah, those guns ain't nothing to play with. So people are terrified when someone pulls a gun on them. And this is why they're so, I guess, um, they're so hard on people who commit armed robberies. But let's see how it goes. What do y'all think? You think that this thing will continue, this trend will continue, or perhaps people will lay low and show a little compassion. You know, take a break from committing crimes like 
the mayor of Houston suggested once. <laughs> Sylvester, that's my homie, man. But Sylvester told, he actually requested that the, crim the criminals in Houston take a break. <laughs> take a break during, during, the, during the lockdown. <laughs> Oh, man. Anyway, fam, that's it. Drop a comment. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?